We're rolling. Okay. What's going on, guys? Am I still in the Yeah. What's going on, guys? Um, I'm gonna do something. I always start off like that. For real. It's harder than it looks. Okay? Hey guys. What's going on everyone? So on my first YouTube video, I got a bunch of comments from you guys with a lot of feedback and I'm so grateful for that. And one of the comments happened to come from Samantha Barton, who's now, I think I'm saying that right. Samantha Barton, uh, who's now a subscriber, and she had a request for me to do another video part two of this fully zipped up leather biker jacket with some jeans and boots show full front and back sides too. So Samantha, I responded to your comment. I said, so you requested, so shall it be done? And so here it is. But instead of just keeping it at showing you just fully zipped up front and back, I'm also gonna take it a little bit step further and I'm gonna show you just two more outfits, fully leather jacket, jeans and boots. Just a couple ways to style it, not doing too much, but also doing enough to make you look more stylish than the next person. All right, so I'm gonna get into this first one. I've got it zipped up like she requested, fully zipped up front and back. Got on some light wash jeans and some wingtip boots to just tie everything in together. Super simple, got a white tee on underneath. Um, take this to the next level by adding some accessories. So in my case, what I did was throw on some rings earrings, a little necklace, an unk, and a watch to really just add a little zhuzh to the whole outfit. Um, but at its core, super basic, but flyer than ever. And also this extremely, extremely good hat that I got from the people over at Gorn Brothers. Unzipped, really, don't mind the wrinkles. Um, really just basic outfit, white tee, jeans, boots, leather jacket. You can't go wrong with that. I'm gonna show you two other outfits that uh, just add a little more to this base, um, just to show you what you really can do with the leather jacket. And once again, for Samantha, front shot, back one. <laughs> I'm not gonna make that mistake again. And yeah, I hope you like this, and I'm gonna show you two more. All right, so for the second one, uh, same base as the last one before, but this time I decided to throw on a flannel, a flannel, not a flannel, a flannel, um, that ties in with the yellow in the boots. Um, just another layer that I'm gonna add on to it. Super simple, doesn't take much thought. It's gonna get colder at some point during the year, and so instead of just going out with the t-shirt and leather jacket, you wanna, like I said, judge things up a little bit, add another layer, throw on the flannel, keep everything else the same, and you change the outfit completely. It adds complexity to it. It adds just a lot more interest. Something happened? <laughs> no. Yeah, so it adds a lot more just interest and complexity to the outfit without you having to do a lot more. And so yeah, man, just throw on a flannel, keep the same base, you're good to go. You got a whole nother outfit. You don't got nothing else to worry about, all right? So now let's get into the third and final one. Right here. Oh. Oh. Didn't see you there. Otherwise, you can put on some Adidas shorts, <laughs> some SpongeBob socks, and white tee. And that'll come together perfectly. Especially if you have some barbecue chicken steaks on your Adidas shorts. That's my cameraman, everyone. Stay classy, ladies and gentlemen. The man behind the mesh. Stay classy, ladies and gentlemen. Let's put the pieces together. But the video's not over. And for the last one, you can just go full on bad boy, replace the white tee, put on a Henley, it could be whatever color you want. I mean, most of the time it's gonna look good anyway. But yeah, replace the white tee, put on a Henley, throw on some dark wash jeans. You can even keep on the jeans you had before, but make sure don't be one of those stuffy bits who just buttons their Henley all the way to the top. Listen, Take it from me, it's okay to show off a little man cleavage, all right? Unbutton them down. You don't have to be like me. I went all the way four, like, what was that? Four, three, four buttons down. You don't have to be that way. But, you know, you wanna, the whole point of a leather jacket is to feel like a badass. You wanna feel like that bad boy. So you don't wanna come with your Henley all the way buttoned to the top like you're, like you're some preppy schoolboy, and then you try to put on your leather jacket. It's like, yeah, just, just lean all the way into it. You're gonna do it. Do it big. So unbutton all the way, or most of the way, at least half of the way, 
you know, get yourself a nice pair of shades. These these didn't cost me much, they're like 30 bucks. I got them online. It just go all the way in. Still, the base is still the same. You got your jeans, you got your boots, you got your leather jacket, you got a simple shirt that you can just throw on. And it doesn't get any more simple than that. Honestly, like this is such a put together look. I have all my accessories on still, same hat, same everything, but I changed the whole dynamics of my look. I now look more presentable, more nightlife ready, while still keeping the same base of the outfit, right? So once again, Samantha, this was for you. Thank you so much for the feedback. Thank you so much for the video suggestion. And this is for anybody who watches. Don't feel afraid to, you know, make any suggestions about stuff you want to see. I would love to make videos based on what you guys want to see and so leave comments down below because i read them all i respond to them all mostly because there is not so many so i can respond to them all but nonetheless i really appreciate it just leave your comments let me know what you want to see and i'm gonna do it i'm sorry samantha that it took about a month and a half to get to this but i had to take care of other content first but Thank you guys so much. This video, my leather jacket video is about to hit 1,000 views. I never honestly would have imagined that for my first video. Uh, it could have just bombed like my second and third video, but um, it didn't. It got to almost 1,000 views in like three months and that is just absolutely monumental for me. And so once again, thank you guys so much for the comments. I really do read them. I respond to them all as you've seen. So just let me know. Let me know what you want to see and I'm going to make it for you. At least I'm going to do my best to make it for you. And let's just keep this ball rolling, all right? So once again, peace. So once again, peeps, till we put the pieces again. So once again, peeps, till we put the pieces together again the next time. Later. And he looked like he could take your